Six ways to build relentless burning desire step by step. If you want it bad enough, you shall get it. Welcome back to my channel, guys, and stay well conversations. Yes, sir. Now, before I get started, though, make sure to smash that like button, share, comment, subscribe, check the link in the description. So let's get into the video. You see, you see, if you want it bad enough, you want to, if you want to be successful as much as you're breathing, then you'll be successful by Eric Thomas. A lot of people I've talked to, a lot of people I've talked to in that, they say we would like about they would like to eat healthy, they would like to have a great physique, they would like this and that. But but when we meet again, it's exactly the same story again. They're exactly in the same place as they were before, or even worse a position, because they want it bad enough. They don't care for it. You see, when you're, you you see when you want something so bad, it will align with your mind, body, and spirit to go towards that thing and grab it. If you do not want it bad enough, if you don't want it bad enough, if that means you don't care for it, you don't value it, then you shall not have it. It doesn't matter whether it's uh, social status, money, influence, power, to be a rapper, singer, pestered, whatever it may be, whatever that you want. If you do not want it bad enough, then your behavior, your your uh, your action, your mindset, everything will not it will not match it to go and achieve that thing. You won't meet the requirement because you don't want it bad enough. And the first step to acquire anything in this world, you have to have burning desire. Ronaldo got burning desire. Messi got burning desire. Floyd Mayweather got burning desire. Pacquiao got burning burn desire. Any person in any field that you see on TV or whatever, they want it so bad enough, so they 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 sweat it for they put their blood, they sweat, the tears into it to achieve to achieve that to achieve that goal. You see the physique by here, it's years and years of blood, sweat, and tears to achieve this physique. Do you understand me? But putting that work in day in day out, loving it, loving the pain, embracing the process, hard work, dedication. Perseverance, persistence, that's what it's take to achieve it. If you, if you do not want it bad enough, then you shall not get it. And your action will not match it. Do you understand? So number one is set clear goals. If you do not have a goal, you've got a map. You've got a map. If you don't got a map, go into going into a jungle, you will not make it. And you won't make it alive. You're probably gonna eat it by a, a gorilla or a bear or something. Do you understand? So you have to have a clear goal. Do you understand? You have to have a plan. Do you understand me? So, and then execute. So, SMART. You know what SMART is? Let me tell you right now. SMART is, S is for specific. So, specifically, what specifically do you want to achieve? What do you want specifically you want to achieve? Do you want to achieve, do you, do you, do you want to um, be a rapper, be a singer, be a, uh, be a president, be a politician? Do you understand me? What's that you want to achieve? Okay, cool. You write that down. You want to achieve it now. Specifically, so now you want. You can't say you want to be a rapper, a singer, a this, a that. No, that's not work. You have to start with one first before you, but before you, uh, before you expand. Like for example, The Rock. He started as wrestling. They, but they conquer that. They move on to acting. When you come to acting, they move on to entrepreneurship. When acting, that's how it works in stages. We have to start with one specific your domain where you're going to dominate. You become a master at doing. Do you understand me? And then go ahead and. Uh, go ahead and um, put, uh, um, um, and the way you call it, and then uh, uh, go in that direction. That's how it works. So number one is specific. M is for M is for measurable. So how you go to measure it? Just what I'm saying to you, because if your goal if your goal is uh, your goal is for example to um, to, uh, to to acquire a hundred thousand hundred thousand in a year, you have to break it down into monthly monthly. Uh, 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 what you call it? Monthly, weekly, daily goals. Do you know what I'm saying to you? Then you build, you, you build momentum. You build your confidence. You, you're in the flow of it. You're in your pocket, and then you go. Eventually, you're going to reach it. Doesn't matter. If it takes one year, two years, three years. Doesn't matter. But that that's how you break it down. So you say you go here, and then you break it down all the way down, and you climb that stairs all the way up to, to going to that goal. Do you understand me? But have the goal in mind, have the goal in mind, but only dwell upon your mind, your body, and be present all just in your process, enjoying it. You, you, you dwell upon that so much that eventually, before you realize, you've reached your destination. Do you understand? So, next thing is, uh, uh, is uh, what you call it, is, is, uh, is action. Do you understand know what I'm saying to you? It's action. So, what action are you going to take? Do you understand know what I'm saying to you? What action are you going to say day day in day out? Do you know what I mean? You want a, you want a great physique. You have to go make sure that you're eating daily, uh, eating daily, meeting your calories, eating the right protein. You make sure you're sleeping right. Make sure that you do stretching. Make sure that you put the work in the gym. Make sure you work at the right tempo. 
that is taking actions daily, daily, and it, to achieve your goal. And T is for, um, what do you call it? T is for, it's time bound. Time bound. So what is, when do you want to achieve that by? That, uh, what do you call it? Um, uh, 100,000, 500,000 uh, to achieve in your business, in revenue in your business. When you want to achieve that great physique, what's the time span? Three years, four years, five years business for you, for, with any, anything I want to achieve, set a time span. So it keeps you, hold you accountable. So hold a minute, as you're going through time and that, okay, I've got, not make you nervous or cause anxiety, but you're aware of it, so okay, cool. That keeps you on your toes, that keeps you, uh, that, 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 that is gonna make you, make it very difficult for you to be passive. So then you know that in back of your mind, okay, in five years time, this is what I want to have in my, in my business. This is the time I want to do it. I want to be, be uh, competing uh, in a combat sport or whatever. Work the time frame to get there. Do you understand me? So uh, that, that's smart. Number two is find, find your passion. What is your passion? What does your heart desire? What gives you a butterfly in stomach every morning? Ah, oh, I can't wait to, I can't wait to uh, grow my business. My, I'm a CEO of a company, I can't wait to grow my business. Oh man, I, I can't wait to go and play uh, play professional football or uh, rugby or golf. Oh, I can't wait to go butterfly in stomach. But I said, I can't wait for it. That is, that is what you, that, that is your passion right there. When you're a child, think about when you was a child, you want to be asking with all these creative imaginations. You want to be this, you want to be that. So curious to know. But as time went on, as time went on, you, you, you mold it into society. You mold it into society, and then guess what happened? Guess what happened? And then you fall into the normal, normal people, me, yoga people do. Do you know what I'm saying to you? And anyway, work consumed, die. Work consumed, die. That's it. Before you know what it is, 60, 70, dream dead. Do you know what I'm saying to you? So you have to know, find, find your, your passion is. And when you have your, your passion, so passionate about it, so enjoy it so much, that is then, that then, your passion then, um, it goes hand in hand with desire and passion. When you're passionate about when you're passionate about something, then you have the desire to achieve that, to, to fulfill that passion. Do you understand me? Number three is uh, what I've got myself right there as well. It's a create a vision board. Ideally, now I'm writing with images. Right now, I've got. I need to. I need to get my. Um, Right now, I'm in the living room recording this video. I need, uh, I need a, a vision board of images, the car I want, the, the house I want, just send me the location, put it down there and look at it, visualize every day, look at it, right? And get that, whatever sees in your eyes will go into your, into your, uh, into your mind. Just what I'm saying to you. And see yourself already in that car, in that house. Just what I'm saying to you. Or see yourself already achieving your goal. Uh, you see me achieving your goal, whether it's, whether it's a, a way you call it, being be a, a footballer or uh, a rapper, a singer, visual stuff, or you're doing that, you know what I'm saying? You're going out, you're, you're touring, just tell me you're, you're going platinum, you're going to visualize that. Then you shall have it. Do you know what I'm saying to you? So a clear vision board. You know what I'm saying to you? Whatever you see in the vision, that will become your reality. You can feel the emotion, feel that emotion that you're already there, that you can see that you're already there, then it's all yours. Do you understand? All this time is going to be, all you, all you, the only thing you're waiting for is time. And that's it. You've got it. Number four, number four is visualize success. That's what I do day in, day out. It's visualize success. I, I sit there in solitude for 30 minutes in the morning, 30 minutes at night time. Saying them. Oh, even though night time it is, it is more challenging because uh, I've consumed a lot of things and I'm, I'm tired as well. So but still, I've got to get it done because I want it bad enough. You say deeply in my soul, and I sit there and meditate. Just you know I'm saying to you, and see myself visualizing all the achieving the goal, the end goal. Don't worry about how you go to get there. But when you visualize it already, then your your mind body your mind body spirit is in correlation, in alignment, in alignment to achieve that to achieve that uh, that goal. You know what I'm saying? It's in alignment. So always keep that in mind. So visualize it. Wherever you, see your, wherever you see your mind, you will see it in your hand, is the saying. Wherever you see in your mind, you will see in your hand. Do you understand me? Because you're, you're the creator to the creator to the universe. And the universe is gonna the universe is gonna then uh, make it happen through people, circumstances, and events. The law of the universe. I highly suggest you study the laws of the universe. Do you understand me? There's seven laws. But I'll get into this video. This video is all about how to build and uh, build a burning desire. So visualize success. Number five. Number five is take action. The law of action. That's one of the law. Law of action. If you do not take action, you shall not have it. You don't deserve it. You're not entitled to it. Forget about it. 
You know what I'm saying to you? Some people don't want this, they want that. But now, are you willing to put in the action? Are you willing to meet the requirement? Because if you don't, if you don't meet the requirement, you shall not have it. You don't, do not deserve to have it. The universe is forever given to everyone. Whatever you want, do you will give. But are you willing to pay your part? Are, are you willing to pay your sacrifice, your persistence, your hard work, your blood, sweat, and tears? Are you willing to do that? If you're willing to do that, then the universe, the universe will, will, will manifest it to reality. That's how it works. So make sure, make sure that you take action on that. Just tell me, whether you're footballing, now you, you're training day in, day out. You come in, you're first to come, first to leave. Your, your diet is the best possible. You take care of yourself, mentally, physically, spiritually, day in, day out. And you, what you call it, then you become the, the greatest ever what you do. That's what it takes. So go, uh, make sure to take the action, relentless action, day in, day out. Attack your life with speed. Attack your life with speed. Then you shall have it. It's all yours. And number five, is this a key one? And then I've, I've, uh, I'm gonna tell you a quick story. Is, uh, is where you could sign yourself with winners, not losers. You understand me? I've signed, I've signed once upon a time with my younger self, I was surrounding myself with losers, just some people that are drinking, smoking, uh, talk about uh, women, what they can do to women, talking about uh, what you call it, just going out to a party and uh, just go, uh, this, this, uh, this, uh, food, this, this, uh, way of entertainment. That's it. That's all people do. And guess what? And that I was coming into that box. I was, uh, uh, I was taking their, their, what you call it, their thinking. I was their, their, their brain was stimulating my brain. Just tell me to act like them, to move like them. Just what I'm saying to you, and that hold me back. If I didn't do back, then at that time, my younger self, I'll be way ahead right now. But I would surpass myself right now if I if I only had my alignment to my purpose or what I want to achieve. Just what I'm saying to you. So that you, you, your friends will either pull you down or uh, pull you or, or uh, lift you up. Whether it's your friends, your family, whatever, do you understand me? So, sign yourself with winners, do you understand me? Uh, if, you sign, if you're a footballer, you sign yourself with footballers, they will become a better footballer. Or you're a golfer, a singer, a rapper, sign yourself with rappers. Any person that you see, they sign with the same group of people that stimulate their brain, their creativity, their imagination to get to, to get where they want to get to. Yes, I'm saying to you, they will get very fast because once upon a time, uh, once upon a time, I had a, had a friend, do you know what I'm saying to you? I had a friend, and uh, uh, what you call it, he sees them, and I wanted it to be so bad to be in great shape. You know what I'm saying to you? To be in great shape and uh, to be my best self, my best version of myself. And he see that in me, and every day he'll go and pick me up and go and go put in the gym. He recommend the books to read. Uh, I'll gravitate towards energy, his mindset. And I, I, I became a monster. <laughs> it didn't take me long to become a monster. So that is the beauty. That's the beauty of uh, having a, uh, what you call it, uh, what you call it um, you can call it a mastermind group, yeah, which is people that are on the same page as you, that are on the same mission as you to, to achieve what, they, uh, what you want to achieve and what they want to achieve. And when you do that, bro, I can tell you that you become unstoppable. You can progress so fast, you will literally blow your mind, bro. You literally blow your mind. That's how powerful it is, that? To have uh, people, uh, people, because you can find the habits, the way they move, the way they think and apply it. Yes, I'm saying so. Uh, uh, if you sign yourself with millionaires, they become uh, millionaires. If you sign yourself with broke people, they become broke people because you can apply their habits and that's how you're going to move. So be very conscious and aware of who you surround yourself with. Remember? But that's the detrimental detrimental of where you can be a loser, loser or winner in this life. And right So, with that being said, that's all God said. I've got six, uh, I told you six ways on how you can build relentless, burning desire to achieve anything that you want in this world. You know what I'm saying to you? Which I apply every single step on this on this on this paper. I apply it every day because of how I feel. You know what I'm saying? So it comes down to you face you. Watch it, look in the mirror and ask yourself, how bad do I want it? You know what I'm saying to you? If you're if you if you light up light up on fire, then you know that you know you're in the driving seat. You know sometimes you're coming a greater version of yourself to give you a mark on this world to influence, impact humanity. Just tell me, it'll be remembered forever. But Lewis don't get remembered. Only kings get remembered forever. You understand? So with that being said, then, uh, the quick recap. Number one, set your goals. Number two, find your passion. Number three, create a vision board. Number, number four is visualize success. Take action day in, day out. And number six, 
sign yourself with winners, not losers. So I've been said that I hope you all take took this action. Um, you have written all this down and you can apply it right now today. Just tell me and let me know how it goes. Comment the feedback. If you have any questions, more questions, comment down below. Make sure to smash that like button, share, comment, subscribe. Check the link in the description and thank you so much for watching. I hope this uh, you, uh, inf uh, motivates you, influences your mind to become the greatest version of yourself. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Yes, sir. Woo!